Oh. Separate. Alright. Obi-Wan and R2, the friends who never hang. <laughs> it's like, I don't recall ever owning a droid. You own two, you asshole! <laughs> I guess, in fairness, he, uh, it, by the time of episode 4, um, his droid is long dead, and he never specifically owned R2, um, but, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's like the way he, he said it was kind of like, wow, it's like, you're really gonna do me like that? He had two R4s, or oh, rather, he? the Republic granted him two R4s. Oh, yeah. R4P17, rip, and R4G9, who got sent to the temple right before Order, right before Order 66 happened. So we don't know what happened to her. Oof. What the heck is this? There we go. No, don't do that. Uh, oh wait. There we go. Got a lot of those all those um protocol droid sounds. Or oh, no, astromech droid sounds rather. <laughs> Because of these games, I thought all of them sounded alike, but <laughs> they actually don't. R4 has her own sound effects. I didn't even know uh, they had, like, different, like, you could tell that the different genders. Like, maybe it's, it's a bit more uh, clear to tell with, like, protocol droids because they have, like, uh... Actual voices. Yeah, actual voices, but, um... Astromex, not so much. Wait, what? Oh, okay, I gotta change. Okay. Trippier, how'd you lose an arm? I don't know. I'll kill you so you can get all your limbs back. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Yeah, somehow. <laughs> I love the part in the episode where, um, 3 is just like, well, I'm, I'm just gonna stand here now, <laughs> and then Anakin, like, literally two seconds after, opens the door and just say, 3 what are you doing? Don't just stand there! <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Uh, 3 is great. Look at that, them, rem them remembering that they have a- uh, oh, for Pete's sake. Look at that, them remembering that they have ascension guns. Yeah. Like, they use that more in the game, in these LEGO games, than they ever did in the movies. Yeah. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the, like, m melee attacks like that should have been a separate burn, because they kind of just- oh, hey. Uh, they kind of just randomly happen. It's a little bit weird. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, they I don't... all be up. <laughs> like, I don't even know. I don't remember any of this happening. They would all be sucked out the airlock. Yeah. I kind of enjoyed this back and forth, though, like what happened in Anakin's side uh, affects what's going on with Obi-Wan. Do I just hit this way? Okay. Okay, oh fair my enough. Oh my god. It's like one of those Metroid other- It's like one of those Metroid other M glory kills. Yeah. Okay. 
probably one of the the probably one of the cooler parts of that game. <laughs> Now I'm imagining the Jedi just trying to use the force to thread a needle. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? Oh, this is a puzzle. Uh, what am I trying? I don't understand what I'm trying to do. Match red with red and blue with blue. Okay. So Mm -hmm. Alright, go to the other one. Alright. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Now do the one on the right. Mm -hmm. One on the right again. Oh, for Pete's sake. This is weird. Oh my god. I don't remember this at all. Maybe he has to do something with Anakin. It's not letting me switch to him. Oh, I can. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll just do this first. <laughs> Thankfully the C-3PO switches are just a very easy Simon Says game. Can I do anything with these? No? Okay. Okay, I see. Right, I was just supposed to copy that. I didn't know he got slower from losing the leg. I mean, that makes sense, but I didn't yeah. know that actually affected you in the game. <laughs> Is that the end for Anakin's side, or...? No, okay. I like the... the when it works, anyway. Um, I like that they let you let the uh, blaster characters um, kind of move to the side if you just keep pressing the fire button. Did you just cold cock that battle droid? Maybe, I think so. <laughs> I don't want to play as Freebio. <laughs> yeah, I... God, what... What the heck is the, like, stud requirement? Jeez. Unless there's, like, a bunch of blue studs in here, I don't think we're gonna get it. Like, be nice though. It's a washing machine, what the heck? There's one in every LEGO, LEGO game. Apparently so.
Okay, I see that, the uh, um, anything else? Is that just gonna God. endlessly drop studs? It's not a lot. No. Okay, I guess not. Alright. Oh, we won may be able to help here. Well, he's kind of stuck in <laughs> uh, puzzle land. Alright, what? Well, okay. Is there absolutely anything else I can do before I switch back? Get stuck, apparently! <laughs> seeing anything. Oh, wait, Padme, she can oh. pull from there. Oh, okay, I yeah. Okay. And then drop this in here. What does this do? Oh, is there another? I assume there's another one? Okay. So we did this. Yeah, my droid buddies. How you doing? <laughs> I really don't understand how you're supposed to like avoid blasters or anything in this game. Like, how you, I don't really know how, how, like, you do the deflecting thing. I feel like it's much easier to do that, to do that in the other ones. Anything else? Just these. Yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Now I have to go back to this nonsense. Uh... Okay, so... So we might just need to have it so it's actually lined up. It's not really working with me here. So then... Okay, so that one, that one turns, it, turns the whole world around, whereas this one just turns the thing in the middle. Oh god, I don't know. Using. Wait, uh, I think I might have an idea. Like, just have these ones line up with the things in the corner, uh, or the corners, and then switch the other one around until it lines up. Wait, is that? I don't know if that's co yeah. I think that might be right. And we'll just keep switching this until it works. I I, I oh okay there we go. Whew. Nice. Oh what sweet hell is this? I 
Hello there. <laughs> oh yeah! I think this is what this scene is. Or rather it's uh, General Grievous doing that, but still. It's kind of, it makes it kind of funny. It makes that scene, the scene in Revenge of the Sith even funnier when you could think of it as um, Obi-Wan just mocking <laughs> General Grievous. Uh, I... okay. <laughs> you gotta send R2 to get the studs. Yep. Can I not disable enemies in this game? Oh, okay. I can. How am I supposed to use that? This is a really long level. It makes sense for them to choose the Malevolence arc though. Like, for the early seasons it was... Um, quite substantial. But I think it was one of the f first few episodes of the show. Oops. <laughs> it was early in season one. Mm. Oh, right, I forgot I can use the force on these. I'm not used to that. That's definitely how it works. <laughs> I'm actually, you know, I think it. I guess that's how it works in a new hope. In a new hope. Mm. In a way. But I know like torpedoes are a thing in actual Star Wars, but I always just associate associate them with just Lego Star Wars specifically. <laughs> oh hey there. They should they they should have had him like jump off from a platform to uh, make it. Uh, keep the uh, hello there effect going. Oh jeez, what the heck? <laughs> More fern stuff at bosses, I say. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, it's grievous. I thought it was a battle droid. <laughs> Since, since when could he do jumps like that? What the heck? He's been, I don't know. He's been at the uh, cyborg workout routine. I don't know. We're tired, folks. <laughs> yeah, he seriously shouldn't be allowed to do that. Like, he has lightsabers, but he's not actually force sensitive, um, and he's not actually supposed to be able to jump that far, or whatever. You can also, there's also a problem with like, what, Crash to Insanity, where um, like, why do we have the Cortex Escort missions when he can just teleport away from danger, like, any other time? But, whatever. Yeah. Okay. Now we can get out. Uh, 
Um, I feel like we should probably like um, be more uh, talk more about this next time. But um, in in general, uh, what would you say is your favorite of the three villains in uh, the the three, the three uh, major villains in Clone Wars? Oh, okay. Um, based off what we've seen in season one, probably. Um, I guess Dooku. That's fair. I do like Dooku. I'd probably agree with that. Uh, so this is a little bit weird. Um, the. Uh, Again, we'll, it's kind of late, so we'll we'll probably end up talking more about the villains next time when we're not um, about to die. But um, yeah, it, if you haven't seen the Malevolence arc, uh, you probably wouldn't know that the it ends with Anakin um, forcing the the massive ship to just fly to the moon or whatever, or a moon. Um, just to make it explode, um, and yeah, that's what you need to do here to finish the stage. It's, it could be worse, I guess, but it's a little bit fiddly how this works. I, I don't really, I don't really get how to control this thing. What am I doing? Oh, okay, I gotta kill the enemies first, I guess. I forgot he did that and did this in the show. Yeah. Oh. Wait, what's the point in this? Oh, what? I, 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 I see. Okay. I thought it just... I thought it just suddenly ends. It's a little washing machine. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how they expected you to get true Jedi without multipliers in that stage. That was kind of ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, best character, clearly. You know, I, I like the droids, but... Yeah. What's your guess for how many gold bricks we're going to have by the end of this? I'm going to say... 35, maybe? How many levels are in this game? Um... Cause I don't, 18, there's, there's the 18 for the three villains. There's the prologue, and then there's an epilogue uh, stage. Um, I don't know if we're going to play these, but I think... Um, I think in the hub you can actually go to, like, the a villain, um, ship, of one of the villain ships or whatever, and you can find, like, two or three special levels where you get to play as the villains. Uh, I don't think we're gonna pl I don't- I don't know if we're gonna play those, though. I don't remember, like, how you get to that. Um, but... Uh, yeah, in regards to um, what we can play here, I think it's 20, 20 levels overall.
So I'm gonna stick with 35. I'm not gonna give a guess. Uh, fair enough. Um, I think we're gonna call it here. So, you got any uh, closing words before we end? It is 2020. We have seen more footage of a new Crash Bandicoot game than Lego Star Wars: The Skywalker Saga. Yeah, that's a fair point. <laughs> like they are really being really tight-lipped about that game for some reason. Like every. Every time I hear, like, little snippets about it, I get really excited, but, like, I can only, I, I can only, like, get so, like, there's only so much I can, uh, learn about the game through sheer word of mouth, like, I <laughs> want to actually see it, um, but, yeah, regardless, uh, hopefully, hopefully we get to see it soon, um, and, um, we'll do more Clone Wars next time, so... Yeah, good fuck goodbye for now, I guess.